right. Check, check. One, two. How you doing, good people? I know I've been gone for a minute, but I've always been here. Had some uh, surgery, and uh, then I had some complications after the surgery, but I'm doing better. So I'm going to show you how to update or change your uh, default settings. Now, if you don't need to do this, don't mess with it. If everything is by default set to how you want it and works good for you, don't mess around with this because you can mess this up if you don't do it correctly. However, I wanted to make some personal changes based on uh, some of the trial and error and things that I found out. And I got tired of changing it every time I would come in here. So I just went and uh, changed the defaults. So as you can see, um, I've added the negative prompts. I don't know if they do anything or not, but uh, I added it in there. And uh, I think this was already set to 10, 25. But what I did was I lowered uh, the compression. I lowered it to one, but it says it closer to one or closer to zero. Uh, it's supposed to be better quality. And I do see the difference. By default, I think it's five. But I do see the difference. So, um, and it doesn't mess with the speed or anything like that. So anyway, let me uh, show you how to do it. Let's get into it. Oh, I want the T-Cache turned on too. And I do say that, you know, it messes with the fingers. It makes it worse. But I haven't had any real issues with it on. Well, I should say, I haven't had any more issues with it on than I did with it off. So this was faster. I mean, it actually cut like, I don't know, I want to say a good minute. Oh, no, I actually cut it in half because I was running at uh, like 12 minutes per um, second or a step. It's like 12 minutes per step. That was a long time. So with, uh, with that, that cut it down to six minutes per step with the T-Cash on, and then, let me see where we're at, here, no, here. Then I turned on, or I installed Flash Intention. So you can see right here, Flash Intention is installed. I didn't do the Sage, because they say the Sage is even faster, but you lose some quality. You know, X-Formers is a little bit faster, and this is supposedly a lot faster. And, uh, but this was like middle ground. So I went with that one. And once I did that, that knocked another minute and a half off. So I'm about here. I'll show you right here. I forgot one in here. Uh, the first one was 334. 334. And that's at uh, 15 steps. At 25 steps, which is what I normally stay at, it's about five minutes. So, but that's how I like mine set, and I wanted to make sure we set that way every time. So, let's get into it. I mean, I'm sorry about this. I have been, <laughs> I haven't done a video in a long time. So, please forgive me. So, we want to go here. So, you go into your main folder, wherever you have it saved, and you want to go into your web UI, and you want to go into your uh, demo radio. Now, the first thing I'm going to tell you to do, if you're going to, do this back it up you can see I have tons of backups where I have attempted to make changes and didn't want to mess up the original one the original one is right here so this is the one that comes with it by default and these are all other ones I have a folder of a bunch of them here and uh, so actually this is the one I'm running right now so if you go back here into the run and you open that up go into edit right here it's just where i just change the name and that's really all you got to do so whatever you have your saved one your original one backed up and then whatever you call the next one just come in here just change the name and save it and then it'll call that one and that's right there so and that's where we need to be so let's go in actually so, do i want to do this one here we'll go we'll just go in the original one because that's what you will be seeing so we're going here. We're going to scroll all the way down to it's a little hard to find. So right here is your quick prompts, which is here. Check 
to these right here. What you see in mine, I changed. I added hip hop dance and I changed what they were. That's here in quick prompts. Change it to whatever you want. And then we're gonna go all the way down here. So right here is where it starts. Start generation, as you saw that. End generation, as you saw that. There's your prompt value. Negative prompt is off, not used. But uh, I turned mine on to see if it worked. Again, I don't know if it does or not. Right here is a video length. The value is set to five. And this is the original one. My, I have mine on 10 now, but it can go up to 120. Now this is just setting it so when you start it, it's set the way you want to set. Because sometimes you you have it that sweet spot, then you will upload it, get it going, put your image in, hit the button and forget that you had to go change it. So this helps prevent from that happening. Uh, don't change this one. I right, hear your steps. This is your RAM. Leave that at six. I've gone to eight, but I didn't see a difference, so I just put it back on six. Um, and this is the last one, which is say leave on 16 but i have mine set to one and here are your steps right here 25. that section is this section right here once you get done save it relaunch it well this shouldn't even be open while you're doing that but if you need to do it do it and uh and then when you open it up you should have a brand new look as far as that goes oh this video is so sloppy i'm sorry y'all <laughs> it has been a minute but I just wanted to get the information out there to you in case you didn't know how to do that. Because I have gone in here, hit that damn button, and forgot I need to change this, I need to change that. So this will help prevent that. Set it however you want it to be the default to what's best for you. That way you'll always have it. You're going to always go back and change it back or change it to something else. Add different quick prompts here if you want. As you can see, I've added a um, view my prompts right here. And uh, all right, well, that's it. So I'm going to try to cut this up and make it sound a little bit better, but I doubt it. <laughs> Don't forget to like and subscribe. And thank you for following me. And I appreciate your time. Have a great day.